Now, Christmas is special. Christian or not, Christmas hits different for each of us. It means so many different things to each of us personally. For some, it means family, reflection, loneliness, gratitude, <laughs> community, Mariah Carey, <laughs> sales, indoor trees. I love Christmas. I mean, I love the songs, I love the movies, uh, the mascot, Santa. Give it up for Santa, you guys. <laughs> Santa fans. The traditional meaning of Christmas is a day to celebrate Jesus. We actually named our son Jesus. We named him Isa, which is the Arabic version of Jesus. And you might be wondering why. Well, Jesus is an important prophet in Islam. And Muslims, we're mad Jesus fans, aren't we? Yeah. Okay, well, there's one <laughs> Muslim here I was pointing at. We were soon to be Muslim. Um, also, we named him Jesus because I'm a brown parent. And therefore, I have high expectations for my kids. So your name is Jesus. Go, lead humanity and get a trade. Carpenters are paid way more than comedians, so. But it is interesting, don't you reckon, that Santa is the mascot for Jesus? Like, it's, it's, a, it's a weird mascot. Jesus and Santa, uh, they're kind of the opposites of each other when you think about it. Like, who was Jesus? Jesus was, he was raised by a single mum. He uh, worked as a trader. He was a humble carpenter. He kept himself fit. He was ripped, had an Instagram body. Uh, he spread a beautiful message. And, and the guy never lost his cool, did he? Even, even though he lived in, under that hot Arab sun, which would have been really harsh on his pale Scandinavian skin and hair, but <laughs> kept it cool. And what a way to commemorate Jesus' life than with a guy like Santa, who is the opposite of Jesus. Who's, who's Santa? Santa, he lived in the snow. He was addicted to milk and cookies, clearly diabetic. <laughs> Unlike Jesus, he never showed us any skin, no topless pics, and... <laughs> <laughs> and he's a shameless criminal who breaks into kids' houses, leaves them, leaves them gifts made by other children he holds hostage in his sweatshop. <laughs> Santa's got red flags, in my opinion. I mean, his songs are so odd, don't you reckon? Oh, you better watch out. You better not cry. He knows when you're, you're awake. He knows when you're sleeping. Stay away from my window, Santa, you creep. I'm not sitting on your lap, mate. I actually love Santa. You know, he, the guy sounds like half of my Muslim friends, you know? Like, he's got a beard, he's got a pot belly, he's an underpaid delivery driver, and... <laughs> And he works over Christmas, doesn't he? <laughs> He's one of us.